All right, guys, this is Trey from Total Justice Gaming. All right, so we're going to go ahead and say this. We're redoing the Kaiser on deck video because, I'm going to be honest, my last deck video was complete and total horseshit. Um, <laughs> hey, he said no F word. He didn't say nothing about it. Like, oh. So, um, this is the revamp deck. Uh, I, the deck did not work correctly. Um, that's the main reason why I changed it up and I built it late night one night and I think that's part of the reason why it sucked. Maybe. It could just be me. I'm a bad player. Um, but we're going to get into this. So our buddy is the original great deity, great sword deity Kaiserion. Or Kaiserion, sorry. Um, and then our hero war flag. Alright, so we're going to get into this. Um, so first up for size threes, we're gonna throw out our tech one up. We tech one burn nova. Um, this is our fourth fire omni lord. Um, this is the original one where it's if you would die, you pay three gauge, discard your hand, and call it. When when you become zero, it puts you back at one. You cannot be dealt damage for the rest of the turn, and this card cannot be destroyed for the rest of that turn. Um, when this card enters the field. Yeah, alright, so when this card enters the field, discard your entire hand and all other cards, put all of the cards other than this card from your field in the drop zone, and this card cannot be short, yeah. Alright, so, he's a 9-2-8 with triple effect. So, in this deck, because our item is Kaiseron all the time, um, we call this to the side, and then we remove a soul, and the game still plays for us. Then we have a triple attack, and then hopefully by that point, we'll have a Kaiseron with double attack. And preferably the better Kaiser on at the point where it just it just makes it to where we just auto win after that turn. Unless we're playing like Zwei and they were like way up on us in life completely. Um, but that's our tech one up. So we play four copies of our buddy. Um, this is our great deity sword, Kaiserion. He's an 835 with a call cost and a ride cost of pay to gauge. Um, this ability, when it's enter the field or ride, put up to one brave machine from your drop zone into this card soul. So that's pretty much every monster in the deck. And uh, hyper energies, hyper energies are also brave machine. And then its other ability is if there are three more cards in this card soul, this card gets plus one crit. So potential of an eight, four, five uh, with ride and soul guard. All right, so we're gonna move on to the rest of our threes. Um, we play four copies of the Super Sword Deity, King Kaiseron. Kaiseron. Um, he's a 10,004 crit, 7,000 defense, size 3. Um, he has a call cost and a ride cost. Let's see, a call cost of put a, put this card on top of a Brave Machine monster on your field and pay to gauge. You won't ever call it. Um, always ride. So the ride cost is uh, put this card on top of a card you're ride on and pay to gauge. He has Soul Guard and then... Um, First ability is if it has three more cards in its soul, it cannot be rested, and its attack cannot be nullified if it's attacking alone. Um, and then the other ability is souls in this card cannot be put in drop zone by your opponent's card effects. All right. So hopefully, like we said with the Burn Nova play, we're already on this, or we can get on this on the next turn. Um, and we have double attack with crit 4 that can't be nullified and a triple attack with a crit 2 and we just go ham with it on but um, that's the optimal world um, but we play for that, that's it for our size 3's we're going to move on to size 2's, our only other card that we ride on is we play 3 copies of the Martian handsome superhero Taco Suke he is a size 2, 4, 2, 3 um, with a call cost of pay 2 gauge or a ride cost of pay 2 gauge. Um, his ability is an act Martian handsome beam, pay 1 gauge. If you if you do declare monster spell, look at your opponent's hand. If there's a card, if the declared card, if there's a card of the declared type in their hand, you gain a life. And then if there are two or more, you get the draw card. You can only use this ability once per turn. This is the name state ability, so you can only use it once per turn. Period. You can't call other other ones and do the same thing over and over. This card, and it has built-in double attack. So like this card is in here because it has the built-in double attack for early game, and the fact that we get to know our opponent's hand is just such an advantage. We can see what we're walking into. Hopefully. Um, First turn, it's great because then you know everything up to their first draw. 
so that's just awesome if you can do it on the very first turn. But this is our other ride because like the king can be put on top of this too because the king just says ride on top of this. Um, but this card is good. I think it's really good. Um, but that's it for our cards that we can ride on. Our other size twos, we play three copies of Metal Dragoneer Gear Drake. He's a 525 with a call cost to put a card from your drop zone. This card's sold, pay one gauge. If there are three or more souls, or wait, if there are one or more souls in this card, items on your field get cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects, and the items on your field get plus one crit. This has move and soul guard. Um, this makes our Kaiserion crit five, our King Kaiserion crit five. Well, the regular Kaiserion's crit five, we have our soul. King's crit five automatically, and then Takosuke will be crit three with double attack, so that's really good. Um, plus, if we have to, we can just move it in the center and absorb attack, so it's good. Um, and then for our remaining size twos, we play three copies of Beast Deity Elephason. He's a 525. Um, free to call. He's got a counter ability. Act. Choose a card you're on right on. On your field. Put this card in the, from the field into the chosen card soul and you may pay one gauge. If you do, you may ride a card with ride and with Kaiserion in its name on top of the chosen card without paying its call cost. Its ride cost. Um, so literally you get you can get multiple attacks. Um, you can get multiple ta an extra. Ninja Arts, when you discard it, gain a gauge and draw a card. Oh, that's pretty good. Evens out your minus. Okay. Actually, that's really good. Um, but anyways, um, so and we can use it for defensive purposes. If they try to attack me, I can use this skill and replace my item, which means that the attack is with. Um, as the other ability, what's while this card is in the soul of a card you're on right on, that card gets counterattack. Um, so it's really good. It helps against decks that have to uh, link attack us a lot with our high defense now because if we're on the king, we're at 7,000 defense. No. So um, it really helps against uh, adventurers now because adventurers are all small attacks but heavy crit and constant link attacking and restanding and more link attacking and it just helps out a lot with that because it prevents them from restanding and just killing us in one turn, hopefully. Um, but that's it for our size twos. Um, Size ones, we play two copies of Cyber Police Stunbat. Um, he's a six one one. So for a size one, his offense is really good. Um, when this card attacks and destroys your opponent's monster, if you have an item equip, draw a card. So in a perfect world, we always have an item equip. So if they let this hit, and most of the time they will unless they have an overabundance of shields just because they want to guard the Kaiseron play if we're still on regular Kaiseron or Takosuke um, they're going to want to guard it so they'll let this hit destroy their monster and then um, we'll get to plus during mid battle plus it, it allows us to keep monsters on the field that wouldn't just constantly be sucked into the soul and stuff like that um, but it's good as a two of next for the remaining size one we play three copies of Beast Deity Tiger Thrust. This is our 4 2 1 that if it's in the soul of a card you're on right on, that card gets penetrated. And then it has the act ability. You can put this card from your hand or field in the card of in the soul of a card you're on right on. So it's just our penetrate. It gives Kaiser on penetrate. That's all that matters. Um, then for size zeros, we play three copies of the beast, the bird deity, Sabird. Um, he's our 3 1 1 that has the same ability as the Tiger Thrust, where you can put it from the field or the hand into soul. Or And it has the act ability if you have six life or less, and this card's in the soul of your item, or in soul of the card that you're, you're right on. You pay one gauge if you do for this turn, that card gets double attack. So aside from Takasuke, he gives both of our Kaiserons double attack, so that's that's good. Um, that's it for our monsters. We're gonna move into our spells. So we're gonna start off with the Nullifies. For Nullifies, we play four copies. I've seen three moves. This is your generic hero world Nullify that says if you do not have monster center, you nullify the attack. Play four copies of that. Then we play uh, three copies of the uh, new defense, a uh, thousand years too early, or a hundred thousand years too early. Thank you, bud. All right, you can only cast this if you're being attacked. So when they're attacking Kaiseron, 
uh, basically you you do it uh, counter nullify the attack and for this turn an item on your field gets plus 1,000 defense. So first time we use it, regular Kaiseron becomes a 6k. Takusuke becomes, I believe, a 4k. It kind of sucks, but it's fine. Um, and King Kaiseron becomes an 8k defense. So, um, and then if you if you were to use this in any other hero world deck, if the if you have a regular item that doesn't have a defense, it would just give it a thousand defense. So, um, but I've run that at three of. That's it for our shields. Um, next we play four copies of Call Super Machine. This is your generic for Brave Machine. You get to search for any card basically you want. You pay gauge, search your deck for a Brave Machine card. This includes Hyper Energy. Um, and put it in your hand, shuffle your deck. You can only cast this card once per turn. Um, it's good. It has to be maxed out in this deck. Um, next, we're going to play four copies of Brave Machine and Hanger. Uh, you can only cast this card if you're a ride or station at a card. Counter. Choose a card on your field, look at the top three cards of your deck, and put up the one card from among them into the chosen card's soul. Put the rest in your gauge. You can only activate this once per turn. So it is a counter, so you can use it on the opponent's turn. You can use it during your turn to rush and get your soul in for Kaiser to where you have crit four, or to where if you didn't get lucky and couldn't put any soul in before you rode the king, get the third soul if necessary in the king to where you have, you can't be rested and you can't be nullified. Um, or if your opponent's playing an item destruction deck, you can counter on the opponent's turn, use it, put a card in soul. It, you, all your items have soul guard except for Takasuke, which Takasuke is not going to really hurt if we lose it. Um, but if we do, we do. Anyways, uh, and then you can just immediately ditch the soul and save your item, so it's good. Um, next, for our other gauge cards, because you have to heavy gauge out this deck, we play four copies of Hyper Energy. This is your play it, you get four gauge, you can only cast it once per turn. Best card in Hero World for gauge. Um, our last spell, we, move on, we have three copies of Prepped and OK to launch. This is our set. If um, so, when you set this card, um, when you ride, you draw two cards. Then you put this card from your field in the drop zone, and then for this turn, you cannot set another copy of this card. And then you can only have one of these set at a time. So set it, ride, blow it up, draw two. Next turn, set another one. Do the Kazarian play, ride, uh, ride again on top of, or you can do the. Um, the elephant's on mid battle and ride superior ride and draw two mid battle and hopefully profit that way too. Um, run it as a three of. If you run it as a two, you don't only hit it, so I have to run it as three. That's probably just my luck though. Alright, so moving on to impacts. So, first we're going to do our impact monsters. We play two copies of Jackknife Kaiserion. This is our 825 size two. Call cost, put this card on top of a monster on your field and pay two gauge. When this enters the field, during your final phase, if it has a Neo Dragon or Brave Machine in its card soul, stand an item on your field, and for this turn, that card can attack during the final phase. And that card gets plus one crit. This card has movement soul guard, so re stand, it makes our Kaiserion uh, crit five, our King crit five, hopefully, our regular one crit five. Unfortunately enough, if we happen to be on Takasuke, it'll make it a crit three, but. Um, We've never actually had that happen, so we're going to hope that it doesn't. So, and then moving on, so our last setup, we played two of the normal impact Brave Energy Full Drive. So this is our, um, you can only cast if you're ride, and if your opponent has five or less life, pay two gauge, deal two damage, then deal damage equal to your opponent equal to the number of cards in the soul of the card that you're on ride. The damage cannot be dealt by this card, cannot be reduced. So the way this card works is you deal the two damage first, then if they have some way to, if it puts them to zero and they have some way to save their life, they have to cast that card then, and then the other effect happens where it deals more damage. So, um, best outcome, you've already played a lot and you have five cards in soul. If you're, and this is like, very rare, but like you deal the two damage, put them at zero, and say you're facing uh, dragons, why would, uh, and they play dry. They play dry, puts them back at five, and this effect burns them for five, so 
this card's good um, because it has the broken text like that. It makes it to where if they have a way to save themselves, you can still kill them after they save themselves. They have to have two responses to save themselves. If they're gonna, if you cast this, they'd have to reduce the first. Well, they can't reduce any of it, so they'd have to respond to it. And I think the only way to get around this is to gain more life. But then, if you have enough soul cards and soul, it just doesn't really matter because there's. I don't think this is a card that can gain you that much life in one turn. Uh, my my best is seven damage in one turn with this card. The generic two that it gives you plus the five in soul. Um, but guys, this is my revamped version of the Kazron deck build. Originally, I was playing the Evil Deity Sword one, but I really wanted to play the King because the King just says it can't be nullified, so that just guarantees you the win. But um. I was playing just the, the original one and the evil one, but like it just wasn't always panning out. The evil ones in certain circumstances. We like to talk to Suke in over the evil one better. But um, let me know what you guys think. Um, I like the way this deck works a whole lot better than the other one that I had posted. Um, let me know what you think, which one you like better. Uh, thanks. Bye.